What's going on YouTube? Dante Legends here and welcome back to some more Final Fantasy 16. Uh, shut your mouth. No, we're back here all the way back. Oh my gosh, they're all talking. Shut up, everybody. Wait, can I fast travel over there? How the heck I do this? So, can I ask? Wait, hold up, it might be stupid. Let's see. It is stupid. All right, now back and they're back and interrupt me. All right, so I'm gonna make our way to East Pool. Uh, I'll do the same thing I did last time. Oh, uh, actually, hold on. I gotta say what happened last time. So I don't know y'all saw that one. Well, no, this the video before the video y'all seen. Not this video, but two videos ago, Final Fantasy. There was like that weird black border around the uh, video. It was because I was trying to figure out how to, because it corrupted on my PlayStation while I was editing. So I had to get a flash drive put in the PC, and then, uh, what's it call it? All right, hold up. Nah, I, oh, oh, jump. Bink, 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 bink. I know, but I had to put the, uh, it was corrupted on my PlayStation, so I had to get the flash drive, put it in, copy it, put it on the PC. Uh, let me talk to this dude first. Excuse me. Uh, yeah, yeah. I, now go, we don't care. We don't care anything you're talking about. We don't. We don't care. When you see. Oh my gosh, you're still talking. Man, I do not care about you. If I do it by accident, I do it by accident. Oh, it's right from me. All right, fair enough. So I did put the uh, flash drive into the PC. Then I started editing. Uh, uh, uh. Die. Combo work. If the claw. If the claw attack. All right, I just missed that. That's crazy. Think, think. All right. Oh, there's a person I did. Oh. Bink. Bink, bink, bink. Oh, flaming. Oh. I started. Oh, oh, okay. Jill? Gotta find this Bryce. Let him know the road's safe. All right. So, yeah. So, I put the flash drive into the PC. And I was starting to edit, right? And say so to to uh, put it on Clip Champ. But I didn't know I need to basically make it a full thing. All right, shut up. Yeah, 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 whatever. Quest complete. So I put it on there, and it turned out I just had to like zoom it out, so it filled up the whole screen. I didn't know that first. So the video, the last video, I fixed it right, and that's computer editing, which I was able to do a little bit. I didn't like go deep into it like that, but. Different type of transition, like little stuff like that. So I have more access to like sound effects and everything. So hopefully, I'm probably not gonna do that much editing on these Final Fantasy videos, but just in general for videos in the future. Uh, Lord Morlock. Ah, yeah, but like future videos, I um, could be editing more, but I also might take away for the daily because how long it takes for it to upload boom that how long it take to edit upload yes yeah, just quiet. stuff like that isn't it? yes quite isn't it mm. you you're Clive Rossfield how the heck you notice me instantly you about to pull a sword out that fast it's me uh, Hannah yeah. Rodney huh? Murdoch's wife Diana. I don't remember her. Oh, I knew it was you. You haven't changed at all. What do you mean? The Lord Marquis mm -hmm. and Jill too. It's so good to see you both again. <gasps> Why not? I don't like the fact you recognized us instantly, though. It's good to see you too, Lady Hannah. Hmm. <gasps> <gasps> uh -oh. 
Uh-huh. If you have time, you simply must come back to the house. I haven't much to offer, but what? what is mine is yours. We we're good. Don't say yes. We should be delighted. Oh my gosh. Hurry up. Trying to get to where my brother is. Oh yeah, so I also got a new game. I already said this last week, a game share, but outside of that. Oh. I can well understand yep. fleeing from those iron blood brutes. Mm. But oh to take to the road at such a tender age. Mm. She's seen the Brandon Mark finally. Wonderful to see you safe and well, Lady Hannah. Now she goes snitch on us to the guards or something. What's going on? You know, stop your crying. Now, but uh, also, in the game, basically, Do you go. Think you will stay here in Eastpool. Rosaleth still enjoys the Mother Crystal's <laughs> blessing, does it not? You could always move. Mm -hmm. This house holds a lot of memories for me. So why is her husband dead? So long as I can live here in peace, here I shall stay. Mm. Okay. Not that it matters. The capital is closed to civilians by order of the Duchess. Mm -hmm. Or should I say, her Imperial Majesty. Oh, is it his mom? Annabella's marriage to the Emperor of Sambrek. Heralded a great many changes here. She remarried yes. the Emperor the Imperial. Of course. Oh, forgive me. I, I didn't mean to. Oh. Please. There is nothing to forgive. Hmm. Would my mother not make an exception for you and your husband? Surely she would not refuse the Lord Commander. Hmm. You haven't heard then. Someone's dead. Rodney passed away on the night of the fire. He never returned. Oh, from he, Gate. he killed my guy. I, I'm sorry. Clive. Mm. My poor child. You look pale. All this traveling must have taken that its time. That is tragic. Insist you rest. We can talk later. You killed her husband. Okay. Yeah, that's that's tough. That's tough right there. Now the um, I also getting like a new table. So and I also have a camera now, so the video should Are be. You sure you don't want to sleep inside. She, he, man, sleeping outside. I can't. Not after what I did. Fair enough. Lady Hannah said she would prepare a change of clothes for you in the morning. Mm. She really has been very kind. Mm -mm -mm. Thirteen years of killing. Yikes. Thirteen years without the faintest glimmer of hope. It was mm. only Joshua that kept me going. I swore that I would avenge his death. That I would kill his killer. That was the only thing that gave my life any meaning. So question, did he steal Joshua's fire? But if it was me who killed Joshua and Murdoch and all the others, then why the hell am I still breathing? I ask myself the same. Hmm? When I thought hundreds died, 
There were so many bodies, so many lives cut short in their prime. That day hmm. in Dalmechia, I... I wanted to join them. I wanted it all to end. I couldn't hmm. bear it anymore. If living meant being that, better to be just another body. Hmm. I'm sorry. Do you remember that night on the balcony? When we looked up at the moon? I said a prayer to that let in the air. That prayer was answered. must have a plan for us. Hey, hey, Clive, do your thing, Clive, don't let you back out. Oh. We should get some rest. Right. Hmm. Good night, Clive. Man, you could have went quave. <laughs> Now, but I also have a table coming in, uh, so I'm going to try to organize everything. I also have a camera, so I'm going to try to see how I can adjust that into the videos. Thank you, yes. Lydia. Mm -hmm. Perhaps now people will not flee at the sight of me. You look just like Elwyn did when he was your age. How did you What'd come you do? to have some of my father's old clothes? Well, before Elwyn became Archduke, mm. our families would often summer together. He and Rodney were like brothers. These clothes have been in a wardrobe for years, collecting cobwebs along with everything else. Mm. Did he tell her the truth about what happened? Well, I'm very grateful for them. And sorry for depriving you of your memories. Not at all. It's what your father would have wanted. Mm. So did he not? <laughs> I'm gonna lie, it does look clean. Thank you, Lady Hannah. Yes, thank you. You've been most kind. No, I should thank you. It may only have been for a short while. But seeing you again took me back to happier times. <laughs> Fare you well. Just realized this man is a prince going through all this bullcrap. East Pool, and you can not change the appearance of the cloud. That's just that would be cool. If we follow right. to the north, it should take us all the way to Phoenix Gate. So we're heading all the way there. All right. So my thing is. Like, did he not tell her that he killed him, or he said, I wait for the confirmation for himself? You, those are Elwins hmm? by the flames. You're his firstborn, Clive Rosfield. Everybody recognize him. Hmm? Oh, you can't fool me, my lord. <laughs> You're the very image of your father. And that would be true even if you weren't wearing his clothes. Dang. The self-same garments <laughs> Hannah was keeping for you, if I'm not mistaken. She always swore that she would never part with them until the day Elwyn's sons returned. And Dang. now that day <laughs> has come. <laughs> Why, you'll be able to take your bearers back as well. My mm. bearers. What do you mean? Wait, huh? What's 
What's going on? Forgive me, Master Mayor. Mm. I was a child when last I came to Eastport. I didn't recognize you. Oh, I'd be surprised if you recognized anything at all. Much has changed since mm. Rosaria fell to the Empire. Not least for the bearers who once served her noble families. Who are the bearers? When the Iron Blood sacked mm. Rosalith 13 years back, many who lost their masters fled here in search of sanctuary. Okay. They returned. Aye. The plan was to send them home once we'd won back the capital. But then the Imperials arrived. Rosaria became a province mm. of San Breck. The duchy was dissolved and they no longer had any home to return to. Ah. Back in your father's day, any bearer who lost their master became a ward of the duchy. We'd hand them over to the sheriffs and they'd be assigned a new position. So they all, quote unquote, belong to me. There, branded, we knew that wasn't an option. So they've been here ever since. And now you want to give them to me? Mm. They're yours by right, Lord Rosfield. Bequeathed you by your late father. And they'd be better off serving you than hiding here. Indeed, many of them used to serve your house. And still consider the Rossfields their masters. Okay. I'm no one's master. Not anymore. They wouldn't be safe with me. Hmm. I understand. You'll forgive an old man his fanciful notions. Been daydreaming for too long. But still, I would ask a favor of you. Hmm? A small mercy. If it is within my power. One of the bearers is an elderly fellow who still swears absolute loyalty to Archduke Elwyn. I don't ask that you take him into your service. Only that mm -hmm. you meet with him. Let him see that Elwyn's son still lives and that he's as fine a man as his father ever was. All right, I, I can do that. I can do that. Thank you, my lord. He sits by the well most days, watching the people go about their business. If you could show him your face, I would be most grateful. Yeah, that's yeah, that's that's agreeable. As fine a man as my father. You're not yeah. so very different, you know. <laughs> Especially dressed like that. Come on, let's go and meet that bearer. Sure. Mm. He's not here. Well, I can't leave without meeting him. I've let the mayor down once already. It would be cruel to disappoint him again. Okay. Right, let's ask around. Someone must have seen him. Why well, would the dude did it on purpose so he could meet more people? Well, no. Unfamiliar faces. Mm. What brings you to Eastpool, travelers? We're looking for an elderly bearer. You wouldn't happen to have seen him, would you? Ah, you mm. mean the old boy who always waits by the well? Yes, that's him. What, mm. uh, what business do you have with him, if you don't mind me asking? You're not from the capital too, are you? We are. No. In a way. Well then, it's a pleasure to meet a fellow Rosalithian. I was born and raised down Market Street. I never would have left oh, well. Archduke Elwyn had survived the fire. It wasn't the same when the Duchess took over, though. All the beatings, the evictions. Oh, well. The levies going up and up and up, even as the blight took half the harvest. Oh, listen to me. Telling you what you already know. I'm sorry. Yikes. We did I'm not know. I'm afraid I can't help you with your bearer, either. Though I doubt he'd have gone far. He comes here every day. Almost as if he's waiting for something. We'll keep asking around, then. Thank you. Oh, well, surprised you didn't recognize me. Good okay, day, sir. lady. What can mm. I do for you? I'm looking for mm. a bearer. 
an elderly fellow who used to serve the Rosfields. Have you seen him? Ah, that old loon. No, no sign of him today. Mm. Funny, he's usually down by the well at this hour, cooking up his fantasy feasts. I'm sorry. Mm. Oh, he worked in the kitchens at Rosalind's castle back in the day. Still thinks he's there now. You'll often hear the poor fool chatting away to the Archduke. Okay. In a dream he is. But better there than here, I suppose. Can't imagine the vice regime stopping. Dang, this could be through a lot. Bearer. Can you? No. Anyway, you'll be around here somewhere. Doubt he has the path to stray too far. Thank you. We'll keep looking. Yeah, that man been through a lot. Hey, hold on a mo. <laughs> Young oh, Patrick, gosh. the chocobo keeper, might know where he is. Young Patrick, He's the old bird under his wing, so to speak. He'll be in the stables. You should go and have a word with him. All right, Patrick, cool. Patrick, the chocobo keeper. Thank you. We will. And where he yet? I'm sorry, Joe. For making you do all this in my stead. It can't be helped if we're to keep up the pretense. Come on, let's head for the stables. The stables we go. So this is, this dude is that loyal. It's crazy though. Man. I feel bad. It feels bad, man. Mm, mm. Where the bloody hell's he got to? Hmm. Excuse me, but is something the matter? It's this bearer I've been minding. I take my eyes off him for one minute and he disappears. He's not in his usual so... spot by the well, nor anywhere else in the village. Oh, so this man just randomly gone. You must be Patrick. I am, but... And hmm. this bearer you're looking for, he's an elderly man who used to work in the Rosalith Castle kitchens, yes? That's the fella. Yep, yep. How do you know all this? I've never seen you in Eastpool before, but you seem to know the place better than I do myself. And explain the situation. So, hopefully, he's not being attacked by anyone. Hmm. Hurry up. What are you doing? You still explaining to this man? Ah, so that's how it is. Well, then. If you're acting <laughs> under the orders of the mayor, mm -mm. you're on about to help me find him. Oh, bro. He's been losing what little sense he had left of late, saying the sheriffs are coming to collect him, and that he needs to go back to the castle. So he I went was to... supposed to watch over him, keep him out of trouble. But if he's walked out on us, there's not a lot I can do. So he went to Eastfield? Well, to Rosario? Understood. You keep searching here, we'll look for him outside. Thank you. I'm in your debt. All these quests are really side quests. <laughs> I hope he hasn't wandered into trouble. I Let's bet he did. Let's see, got my health bar. You know he did. About to go ahead throw throw the hands on some random things. Speed boost through the grass. Now. Still no sign. Oh, are you going here? Wait, did I take it this halfway? Probably not. All right, so yeah, I want to use. I'm gonna be using a camera soon after everything. I get everything, of course. So that's gonna be cool. Uh, got gonna have a different setup. Gonna like move my room around. Well, get help to move my room around so I can do it myself. That should look super good. What's happening? There's someone over there. It might be him. We should hurry. Hey, let's. He might get attacked. Company. Or I might get. Agreed. Hmm. Oh, man, go disappear by the time we're done, RC. Flashed up. Bink, bink. Bink, bink. The fact you get just flashed up into the air. Oh my gosh. The old man doesn't notice. You know what? I'm gonna ask any questions. My goodness, the juggles. Hey, watch this though. Oh, body bag. Oh 
Oh, you really shot it. Crazy. Man, that's lightweight. Come on, bro. Stop playing with me. Right. <laughs> oh, wow, that looks amazing. Mm. Are you all right, my friend? Come on. Let's go home. Your grace. Yeah. You came for me. I don't I know who this is. So long, but you finally came. I feel so bad. Not who you think. Mm. Clive. Clive, the great wanderer. Pray forgive my long delay. Is he just your grace? I pray to the founder that you Is he just pretending to be his dad? Long last, he answered. Will we be returning to the castle then? Hmm. There is still a place for me in the kitchens. No, my friend. Hmm. We will not be returning to the castle, not yet. I'm on a very important expedition. Dang. One which yeah. may take some time. You wait for me in Eastpool mm. until my journey is complete. I will come back for you then. I promise. Of course, Your Grace. For you, I would gladly wait until my dying day. Son, tell me you'll be dead by the time we do that. Uh, well, at least you're back in the town. <laughs> Thank you, both of you. You've been most kind. The memory of serving the late Archduke was his one light in the darkness, and now that light burns a little more brightly. Yeah, yeah, it's no problem. A fantasy, of course, but it's better than the truth of the matter. Damn sight better. Fair. The blight is on our doorstep. Mm. Our harvests are failing. The people are leaving in droves. If mm. it weren't for Lady Hannah selling half her worldly goods to provide for the few of us who stayed behind, we would long since have stopped. Then she is carrying. She put y'all on her back. Safe here, we really do. But a miracle happens. We won't be able to spare a crust of bread to share between them soon enough. Mm. Is it really that bad? So bad, I even petitioned the Imperial Garrison to take them. But when they found out where they'd come from, they damn near spat in our faces. Mm. Ducal dogs, they called them. Enemies of the Empire. I know a man named Sid, mm. who would gladly give a hug to any bearer in need of one. Leave this with me. Yeah. As soon as I return from Phoenix Gate, I'll speak with him. Thank you, my lord. Oh yeah, so they could. Yeah, that's cool. When you be passing through Eastpool on your way back, I should very much like to speak with you again, if you have the time. Yeah, sure. Regarding the future of the village, mm. and what might be done for Lady Hannah. After all, she's done for us. Me readjusting yes, my chair. I'll be back anon. Fare you well, my lord, my lady. Mm -hmm. I wish you a safe journey. Yeah. Quest complete. Back in the day, you know what I'm saying? Alright, let's finally get to the place we need to be. All this side quest. Now we can finally dip. All right, let's get to Penis Gate. R two. Yeah. Oh. I didn't realize they were this close. No wonder their crops are failing. The blight is leaching the ether from the soil, and when the last drop cool. is drained, their fields will turn to this. No plants, no animals, no life. And no monsters. Mm. I suppose that's one small mercy. We won't be able to use any magic here. No Nothing magic. to worry about. As if the absence of ether didn't cause enough problems. Take away the lad's life force. 
and problems are all that's left. That's interesting. So this place took away the magic from the grass. I can hardly imagine and, what oh. this place used to look like before the blight took it. I remember. It was beautiful. Yeah, then you know. Now it's this. So the magic's gone, so if I fight, I gotta basically be ready to go crazy. Oh, got seen. Hmm. There it is. Phoenix Gate. Oh, so we're almost there. Where it all went wrong. Come on, hmm. Clive. Let's do it. Time to discover the truth. Yes, it is. Go, Clive, go. Go, Clive, go. Wait. What's happening? Is it going to teleport me straight there? Or? No, I do get teleport straight there. Let's get going. So wait, this has not been touched since he went berserk. Phoenix Gate ruins the Imperial Province of Rosaria. What a gentleman. It's almost as if mm. time had stood still. I suppose no one had any cause to return here. No. It's just as I left it. Dang. What was that? I'm not understanding. Let's have a look around. Buried memories. Well, this is the perfect way to end off. It's been double two episodes of straight up storyline, which I don't mind, but we will need some action sooner or later. But like, comment, subscribe. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. And music hit.